That's right, you guys. It took a few years, and it is official. It is being reported by ESPN's Adrian Wojnarowski that free agent forward Thaddeus Young is finalizing a deal to sign with the Phoenix Suns for the rest of the season. Thaddeus Young, who is 35 years old, is averaging five points per game, 3.3 rebounds, and 2.2 assists in 15 minutes a game for the Toronto Raptors this season. And Bobby Marks had a tweet saying that Phoenix was allowed to sign him because of his $8 million pre-existing salary was below the $12.4 million non-tax mid-level exception, which I believe means he is double dipping. And I do believe that Thaddeus Young is going to bring big man depth to this roster. He's very versatile. He's got high IQ, a very experienced player in this league. I think he is going to contribute. He's played what, like 16, 17 seasons in this league, and that should not be taken for granted. That is a ton of experience that I believe can help this Phoenix Suns team. Even if Thaddeus Young plays like 15 minutes a game, I do think that he's going to be able to contribute across the board statistically. I'm curious if we're going to see him out there with the big three at times, maybe playing some center and forward with Kevin Durant out there. I'm really curious if we're going to see that happen. And also shout out to AZ Sports Zone, also known as Zona Hoops on Twitter, who shared a tweet talking about the Phoenix Suns players who they can legally afford. All the names are on the screen. Now, keep in mind, this tweet is a few days old. I'm sure some of these players are already on the move or they're just staying with their teams. But these are the players that the Phoenix Suns can legally afford. And then he also shared a list of buyout market players the Suns cannot legally add. For example, like Kyle Lowry, who is already with the 76ers, Spencer Dinwiddie, who went to the Lakers, etc., etc. And as I was prepping for this video, Dwayne Rankin from the Arizona Republic did put in his article that sources have informed the Republic that the Suns have also shown interest in Danilo Gallinari, who was released by the Detroit Pistons. The Phoenix Suns still have one roster spot left to fill, so do me a huge favor, you guys. Get active in the comments section. What do you guys think about the Phoenix Suns signing Thaddeus Young for the rest of the season? Who should the Phoenix Suns sign with that final roster spot? Any and all thoughts, put it in the comment section down below. My name is Brandon, a.k.a. Suns Geek, and if it has to deal with the Phoenix Suns, I'm going to make a video about it. Make sure to Hulk smash that like button. And as always, win or lose Phoenix Suns for life. I'll see you guys next time, and go Suns. Suns Geek, appreciate it.